Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tenager, and we're playing some Undertale. Now, we're gonna go see Papyrus again, because I realized that I hadn't actually done the date. I went back and looked at the other footage, and went, oh, I went into his house, but I didn't do the date. Maybe I have to do that before I can become friends with, um, what's her face? Undine! So, we're gonna try doing that after we listen to the phone. Oh, right. <laughs> see that building in the distance? That's the core, the source of all power for the underground. It converts geothermal energy into magical electricity by... Uh, anyway, that's where we're gonna go. In the core is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. And from there, you can go home. Click. <laughs> Click, I don't think you want me to go home, Alphys. <laughs> oh, my cursor's on screen. Let's not have that there. It's an elevator... Let's go in the ele elevator. Please select a location. Left floor. <laughs> We're going left. <laughs> it's an interesting elevator. Okay. I already made sure that I could get back to this area. Because I didn't know if I, you know, could. So, I haven't seen further than this. Ride the boat, yes. There we go, let's go to Snowden. So we can go see Papyrus. And the infinitely superior Sans. What? I like Sans better than Papyrus. I I am not sorry. Cha la la la, what's my name? It doesn't really matter. Do 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 Come again sometime, cha la la. You're not creepy at all. Aw, it's a in music again. Hi, Pappy! Hi, Papyrus! Hi, Papyrus! Let's go in your room. Okay, I'll talk to you. Hi. Oh god, I have to do Papyrus' voice again. <laughs> so, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start hanging out? Begin the hangouts? Sure. Okay, let's hang out! Let's hang ten. Alright. Why am I in a fight? <laughs> Why am I in a fight? Hangout start! Here we are, hanging out! I've actually never done this before. But don't worry! You can sp can't stop bad without several letters from my name! What? I snagged an official hangout guidebook from the library! We're ready to have a great time! Please don't make me lose my voice again, Papyrus. <laughs> Let's see! One, press the C key on your keyboard for the friendship HUD! Okay. What the fuck? <laughs> Wowie, I feel so informed! I think we're ready for step two! Step two! Ask them to hang out! Ahem! Human! I, the great Papyrus! <laughs> oh god, my throat. We'll hang out with you! <laughs> really? Wowie! I guess that means it's time for part three! Step three, put on nice clothes and show you care! Why is there a crime statistic? Also, apparently it's Thursday. And why is the population going up and down so quickly? <laughs> Sorry, I just noticed that the population is just rising and falling every second. Okay. Sorry. <clears throat> Wait a second! Wear clothing! That bandana around your head! I'm not wearing a bandana! You're wearing clothing right now! Not only that! Earlier today, you were also wearing clothing! No! Could it be? You got my healthy from the very beginning! Uh, sure. Uh-oh. 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 You're way better at hanging out than I am! <laughs> no! Your friendship hour! <laughs> what? <laughs> What? 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 Don't think you've rested me yet, tension! <laughs> I, the great papyrus, have never been beaten at hanging out, and I never will! I can easily keep up with you! You see, I, too, can wear clothing! In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes, just in case someone wants to hang out! Behold! I think I have water. Oh my god! 
Now, what do you think of my secret style? I love it, dude. No! A genuine compliment! Sure, let's call it genuine. <laughs> However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, when you trust that is invalid, this hangout won't escalate any further unless you find my secrets. But that won't happen. Hmm. Is it his head? My hat! My hat! My hat! Yeah! Really? First try I found- okay. I suppose I have no choice! It's a present! A present just for you! Is it spaghetti? It's spaghetti. He wrapped spaghetti! Right! But oh so wrong! This ain't my plane or passer! This is an Asian's work! Soak in spaghetti by the agent and ocean cask! And cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus! You win! It is time to end this! There is no way this can go any further! Nom. If I feel these scratches up! This is indescribable! <laughs> what a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking! And by extension, me! Maybe even more than I do! It's clear now! I need more water. Mm. You're completely obsessed with me. <laughs> Human, I want you to be happy too! It's time for me to express my feelings! It's time that I told you! I, Papyrus! Hmm. Well, I'm flattered you care so much. But maybe cool it a bit a little bit. You are a very nice person. I'm glad we're friends, but... I think you can reach your max potential. If you live more and for your own sake rather than just for mine. Yeah, sure, I was living for your sake. Hey, I know the solution! You should hang out with my boss, don't die! I think you can spread your friend energy out more. You'll have more healthy lifestyle! Yeah, let's be friends with don't die! Yeah, no, 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 no. Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number! You can call me anytime! I don't agree. Well, gotta go! <laughs> I hope I don't have to do that voice ever again. <sighs> By the way, it was entirely that voice that made my th that made me lose my voice about a week ago. <laughs> Doing Papyrus's voice. <laughs> I'm alive! <clears throat> Kind of. Ta la la, care for a ride? Yes. Let's go to the waterfall. So then we can go see Undine and hopefully become friends with Undine. Because that would be, you know, nice, right? I've got a feeling I'm gonna end up with the true pacifist ending anyway. Even though I'm not specifically going for it. Just because my personality is very, can't we all just be friends? <laughs> Make everyone happy. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Let's call Papyrus. Pappy! Ring, ring, ring. Is the river person there today? Yes. Oh, nobody picked up. <laughs> Damn it, Papyrus. I know his name's Papyrus, just don't, don't, don't. Hi, Doug! It's a little bird wants to carry you across! I wanna take the bird's offer. Boop! <laughs> it sounds so epic, and all it's doing is just grab me by the hair as I'm probably screaming and exiting existential torment as my hair is being slowly ripped from my scalp <laughs> and takes me across the river. Why don't they just put a bridge there? Or something. Like that. Hi, Sands. Hi. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. 
It's not really good. No, I've already done this. You can use it for free, how's about it? Maybe later. Cause Sans is apparently everywhere. Wait, no, I went I went the wrong way. <laughs> I went the wrong way. Went the wrong way. Is it this way? No. Did I go the wrong direction? Was I supposed to cross the river? I can't remember. So the bird wants to carry you across, except the bird's offer. Yeez. And now I'm going to get my hair ripped out right now. Because there's literally nothing else he could be holding on to other than my hair. Also, funnily enough, my hair's not as that much longer than the kids. Oh, there it is! Hi, Papyrus. Hi, Papyrus. How you doing? Oh, the human arrives! Are you ready to hang out with Undyne? I have a plan to make you two great friends! Sure. <laughs> this is going to end poorly. Okay, stand behind me! Oops. Make sure to give her this! She loves these! That's not a dog food! Hi! Oh, wait, what was po Undyne's voice again? <clears throat> Hi, Papyrus. Ready for your extra private one-on-one -on -one training? Extra private? What? You bet I am! One-on-one? -on -one. And I brought a friend! Hi! Hi, I don't think we... <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you two come in? <laughs> Undyne is displeased! <laughs> Here, Undyne! My friend brought a gift for you on her own! Yeah, sure. Uh, thanks? I'll, uh, put it with the others. <laughs> does he do- Oh my god, he does this a lot, doesn't he? So, are we ready to start? Whoopsie doopsie, I just remembered! I have to go to the bathroom! You do have fun! <laughs> what the fuck, Papyrus? <laughs> what the hell? So, why are you here? To rub your victory in my face. To humiliate me even further. Is that it? No. Then why are you here? <laughs> Exclamation mark! Wait, I get it. You think that I'm going to be friends with you, huh? Right. Uh, sure? Really? How delightful. I accept. <laughs> what? there. Let's all frolic in the fields of friendship. Not. Why would I ever be friends with you? If you weren't my house guest, I'd beat you up right now. You're the enemy of everyone's hopes and dreams. I will never be your friend. Now get out of my house. Papyrus! Dang, what a shame! I thought you and I could be friends with you! But I guess I overestimated her. She's just not up to the challenge. Challenge? What? Papyrus, wait a second. Darn it. He thinks I can't be friends with you? <laughs> what a joke. I could make friends with a wimpy loser like you any day. I'll show him. Listen up, human. We're not just going to be friends. We're going to be besties. <laughs> I heard you have a bestie, excuse you. <laughs> she had a baby. I'll make you like me so much. You won't be able to think of anyone else. <laughs> it's the perfect revenge. I think you're mistaken there, Undyne. 
Why don't you have a seat? Okay. Sit down and progress? Sure. <laughs> Comfortable? I'll get you something to drink. Why does she have a- her gigantic sword is just sitting on the ground. Um. All set, so what would you like? What the fuck? What the fuck, Undine? Um. Why not just point to what you want? You can use the sphere. Okay! <laughs> Sickly yellow liquid. Hot chocolate. Tea box. Blatantly correct choice. Tea, huh? Coming right up. I, I actually really like tea, so. <clears throat> I prefer it with honey, but. Also, Undine, I think you broke your table. <laughs> I think you kind of broke it. It'll take a moment for the water to boil. Okay. Yay! I didn't move! I didn't move and I don't kill me! <laughs> okay, it's all done. Can I get up? <laughs> Can I get up or are you gonna kill me? You broke the table. Here we are. It's gonna slide down the table. Careful, it's hot. <laughs> it's not that hot, just drink it already. Take a sip of the tea, it's burning! <laughs> Other than that, it's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good, right? Nothing but the best for my absolutely precious friend. Sure. <laughs> Wait. <clears throat> Sure, Undine. Please don't kill me. Hey. You know, it's kind of strange that you chose that tea. Golden flower tea. That's Asgore's favorite kind. Actually, now that I think about it, you kind of remind me of him. You're both total weenies. Sort of. <laughs> sort of? Define sort of? You know... I was a pretty hothead. Are we now talking about our childhood, Undine? Once, to prove I was the strongest, I tried to fight Asgore. To emphasis on tried. I couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time, he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. Afterwards, he apologized and said something goofy. Excuse me, do you want to know how to beat me? I said yes, and from then on, he trained me. One day, during practice, I finally knocked him down. I felt... bad. But he was beaming. I had never seen someone more proud to get their butt kicked. <laughs> anyway, long story short, he kept training me. And now I'm the head of the Royal Guard. I'm the one who gets to train dorks to fight. Like, uh... Papyrus. Yeah, he's kind of a dork. <laughs> he's a total dork. <laughs> but, um, to be honest, I don't know if I can ever let the pirates into the Royal Guard. Don't tell him I said that. He's just... well... I mean, it's not that he's weak. He's actually pretty freaking tough. It's just that he's... he's too innocent and nice. I mean, look, he was supposed to capture you, and he ended up being friends with you instead. I could never send him into battle. He'd get ripped into little smiling shreds. That's part of why I started teaching him how to cook, you know? So, um... Oh, so you're the reason! <laughs> so, um, maybe he could do something else with his life. Oh, sorry, I was talking for so long. You're out of tea, aren't you? I'll get you some more. Okay. Oh, it's like, are you gonna stab me in another, another spear? Wait a second. Papyrus, his cooking lesson. He 
was supposed to have that right now! And if he's not here to have it, you'll have to have it for him! <laughs> what the fuck? Hi! <laughs> what? 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 That's right. Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer than cooking. Which means that if I give you this lesson, we'll become closer than you can ever imagine! <laughs> Afraid? We're going to be best friends. <laughs> Why is my people are grabbing my hair? Let's start with the sauce. It just falls out the ceiling. Envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy. Now, pound them to dust with your fists. How will you pound? Strong! You punch the vegetables in full force, you knock over a tomato. Yeah. Our hearts are uniting against these healthy ingredients. What the fuck? I'm sorry, guys. I <laughs> just... We're at the end of this video, by the way. My name is Miss Guy the Tanager, and we will keep going with the hangout with Boondine in the next video. My name is Miss Guy the Tanager, and I will see you all in the next video.